Good morning children. Welcome to the online session of Sri Gogulam Public School Gurudwara. After completing the chapter that is share capital now we are moving to the new chapter under companies accounts that is issue of debentures. The content of the chapter is meaning and characteristics that is features of debentures, meaning of bond difference between debenture and shares types of debentures issue of debentures for cash at par at premium and at discount issue of debentures for consideration other than cash issue of debentures as collateral security accounting treatment of interest on debentures now let's, let's proceed with this chapter here is the meaning of debenture Debenture is a written instrument or document issued by the company acknowledging a debt. So debenture is like a borrowing. So we can say it is a written instrument or document which is issued by a company in which they acknowledges a debt. Com Section 2330 of the Companies Act 2013 have defined debenture as debenture include debenture stock, bonds and any other instrument of the company evidencing a debt whether constituting a charge on the asset of the company or not. So this is the definition given by Companies Act. Now who is debenture holder? The person to whom debentures are issued are called debenture holder. So this is the meaning of debenture. You have to understand that debenture is an written instrument or document which acknowledges a debt. Now characteristics and features of debenture. Debenture is a written document or certificate acknowledging debt by a company. So a company have taken a debt and they are issuing a certificate or acknowledging that debt through a document. Mode and method of repayment of principal and interest is fixed. So here uh, uh, in debenture the mode of payment of uh, mode of payment and the period of repayment of principal amount and interest amount is fixed in advance. Rate of interest on the debenture is specified it is a practice to prefix debentures with the rate of interest that is so whenever you uh, in this chapter you can see that whenever there is the wording debentures a percentage um, uh, that is a, um, a figure with a percentage is given so this figure means interest rate 9 percent is the interest rate given in this example so whenever in front uh, there is a practice of prefixing a percentage rate of rate of interest along with the word debentures. It is borrowing of the company. Debenture is what? Borrowing. So whenever a company is in need of fund they used to borrow. So debenture is one way of borrowing. It is normally secured by way of charge on the asset of the company. So the asset of the company have to be uh, are on charge. Okay. So as a secure a security, the assets of the company are put into charge. Interest on debenture is a charge against profit. So when uh, the interest on debenture is a charge against the profit. So you have to pay your interest on uh, from the profit of the company okay so this is the characteristic features of debentures now what is bond bond like debenture is an acknowledgement of debt so bond is also an acknowledgement of debt which is issued by the company and signed by an authorized signatory the rate of interest in bond is not predetermined the only difference uh, between debenture and uh, bond is that in 
debenture we prefix the interest rate and it is uh, already in advance it is fixed but uh, in bond the rate of interest is not predetermined example some of the examples of bonds are deep discount bond and zero coupon bond so in short note or one marks sometimes you may be uh, um, you may ask in the exam paper about what is bond uh, what is the difference between bond and debenture what are the examples of bond so these three points you should remember regarding bond now next concept is the difference between debenture and shares in our plus 1 classes we have already discussed this term let us have a review on these things ownership Deb debenture is debt of the company therefore a debenture holder is a lender so uh, a company when they are in need of money they borrow money from the lender so who is our lender the lenders in case of debenture we call them the venture holder okay so they give the company money okay so debenture is like a debt for a company and what about share share is capital of the company hence a shareholder is the owner so shareholder is a person who gives money in the form of capital to the company and the shareholder is regarded as the owner of the company but debenture holder is a lender of a company now return debenture holder gets interest at the stated rate whether the company earns profit or loss e uh, the case may be profit or loss the company may be earning profit or loss during that period but even if it is a loss the debenture holder should get the interest as per the decided rate but it a share a shareholder gets dividend on his investment a shareholder what he gets in return of his investment he gets in dividend but debenture holder he gets interest now regarding repayment debentures are issued for a specified period hence the amount of debenture is repaid on the due date so debentures are issued at a specified period so the date of repayment of a uh, uh, debenture it is already decided hence the amount of debenture is repaid on the due date itself okay so when the due uh, this debt money should be paid it is decided the due date of that money will be decided in advance so its specified period is uh, decided normally the amount of share is not repaid during the lifetime of the company however preference shares have a specified life and are redeemed on due date so as you know there are two classes of uh, shares equity shares and preference shares for equity shares they they are sh uh, they are shareholders of the company for a life time of the company so no need of repaying the amount back to the shareholders but in case of preference shareholders there is a, uh, a due date for re re redemption of uh, capital money it is specified issue at discount debentures can be issued at discount also but when we were discussing the chapter shares from that you may know that shares cannot be issued at discount but there is an exception that when uh, where they are issued at swept equity shares if they are issued at swept equity shares which is one of the case related to shares so uh, at that time they can be issued at discount otherwise it cannot be issued at discount now regarding security debentures may or may not be secured by a charge on the asset of the company if the company is not paying the debenture holder the money back then the asset of the company will be taken to repay the debt okay so that is a charge on the assets of the company it is secured yeah, as a security the asset of the company is uh, uh, taken into uh, taken as a charge now shares are uh, for shares uh, it is not secured okay are not secured 
Now convertibility debentures can be converted into shares. Shares cannot be converted into any other security. Voting rights debenture holder do not have voting rights because they are just the lender and not the owner. So once they repay the money, uh, then their relationship as a lender will be over. The company's relationship with the lender will be over once the repayment of uh, money uh, lended by the debenture holder is repaid then the relation will be over so they, they don't enjoy the voting rights they don't have any right on the company uh, but equity shareholders uh, have the right to attend and vote in the general meeting because they are uh, owner of the company they have the voting right uh, as well as uh, mm, they have the right to attend the meeting also the risk debenture holder are relatively safe secured debentures are almost risk free so we can say that debenture holder are relatively safe shareholders are at a greater risk they can even lose the uh, amount invested in shares so a shareholder is in more riskier than debenture holder we can say Priority as to repayment of principal. In case of winding up of the company, payment of debenture is made before the payment of share capital. So debenture holder will be given first cash. When the company is going to shut down its business that is winding up, then the who will get the first amount? The debenture holder. They are the lender of the company. They will be getting the first payment. And then only uh, uh, shareholders will get the uh, payment. Okay. So, these are the difference between debenture and share.